Well, hello, business owners in Tenerife. Uh, my name is Wolfgang, or Wolfie, some people call me, and I'm just making this little video especially for you so um, that you can see how these local business listings work here. And hopefully, through the video, I'll be able to answer one or two of your questions. Uh, so, here we go. I'm in Google.com, by the way, not Google ES, to show you how these things work all, all around the world. So let's start off with excursions Tenerife. Uh, quite a few people search for that. Uh, we've always talked to myself when I'm doing this. So let's have a look. And you see here straight away that we've come up with the Google listings. In this case, there's no paid for advertisements across the top. There usually is for, for most things. But anyway, this shows you how the listings look. And then you have a little map here showing where these bits are located. Um, so let's have a little look at uh, one of these. This is uh, Tenerife Excursion. So let's have a look at the place page to show you what that looks like. Let's give it a little time. It is an owner verified listing. Uh, so you got a picture there that could be a picture of your shop or, or whatever uh, so you need to travel an excursion strangely I've not heard of that one um, but anyway oh, it's near Hotel Columbus it says here but also if you click on this little more button here it, oh, that says send hang on directions here it will show you how to get there um, just give it a second to load um, and now it asks you where your location is so you type in your location let's say you were staying in Bougainville Hotel or something like that uh, and then click the get directions and it'll show you it'll show you where how to get to that particular store okay let's go back now so what happens with these listings let me just show you that they come up with the organic listings below these are the organic ones so you can see that but what I'm gonna do now I'm just gonna type in here I'm gonna type in um, Google and Russia oops there's two S's in Russia isn't there well we've got it there and there we are let's click this and we're in Google Russia now so let's type in excursions 10 uh, reef now you might be saying well a Russian person wouldn't type that in uh, they'd type it in in Russian there's good news there too because these listings we can put into any language we want to uh, because we're living in a multilingual um, area so we're allowed to do that so then if the Russian person put the Russian equivalent to that in the listing will actually come up in Russian now can you see how powerful a strategy this is or it'll come up in German if, if um, if you typed in from Germany or wherever wherever else let's just type in quickly I don't want to make the video too long I know people get bored go Germany so there we have Google Germany normally says Deutschland there but never mind you can see it's in German anyway so we're going to type in again excursions 10 uh, reef cool. and you see we've got exactly the same results as we have in Tenerife and of course the same thing's going to work in England as well um, so I hope you can see the power of that. The only difference we've got is that we've got a paid for list in here so people are prepared to pay for these positions and that's basically why um, Google decided to change the way it's 
giving the results. It's helping local businesses. They found that over seventy percent of people now go online to find uh, whatever it is they're looking for, and that's particularly true for holiday makers. Now I'm going to answer another question. Uh, you may be saying, "Let's go back into Google.com before we do." Google.com. I'm going to do this on a, a worldwide uh, search. Um, you're probably wondering what I'm talking about: websites being optimized and uh, Google listings being optimized. The fact is that if you make the listing a very, very good listing, you link it to a good optimized website. Uh, that that it'll um, work together with the listing. I'm going to show you a demonstration of this. I'm just going to type in here Google Help. Let's just, I'm just put Google Help in. I'm trying to show you what optimization is because people don't actually look for websites. Uh, they stumble across them. So this is, I'm gonna, hopefully going to demonstrate this. Google Help and as you can see there there's 2 billion 590 million results uh, for that particular term. Now, of course, my business, which is Help Local Business, um, is not going to come up number one for this term, is it? But if we have a little look through here, you'll find that all the, these other listings are Google, which of course there will be. Uh, but then right underneath, we've got first page of Google, Local Marketing Online, Help for Local Business. And you can see what it's done. It's gone into my uh, website and it's highlighted Google, Help, and Google. Then, if we come down a little further, you find another one of my websites here, Wolfie Worldwide. Um, and you can see that term there, Google Help. That's not on my website like that. I'll show you where they've got that from. Hopefully, you watch this on a, a full screen. Hopefully you can see here wolfyworldwide.com tag Google help. Um, so you can see they've actually gone to my meta tags to find that. And that's where they've got that from. This won't work if, they, if the website is not very well optimized. But I'll just show you something else about things working together. Let's just put in here uh, online help for local business and you see that has got uh, 1,680,000,000 results. Now these results are not people searching for it, these are people that are competing for that particular term. Now you see there that we've got two paid for ads on here so it's quite a powerful um, search is something that gets searched a lot and I think you'll find that I'm number one there and that's above a UK government site business link uh, which actually has a page ranking of eight my own site has a page ranking of two now uh, which is not bad being as I only well, started it last November so it's, it's just under a year old at the minute but I hope, hope you can see the power of that. Now what I'm going to show you is you can see my picture there. If I go into images, it takes a little while while I'm making these films, but you'll see my pictures there. If I go into videos, you'll see so there in position two are my videos, YouTube, Wolfie Worldwide channel. And there's three videos there. Let's see if there's any more there. No, I've only got that, that one there. But anyway, and now let's go into maps and let's see what happens there. And here's my Google listings. Number one is uh, the Google listing in Tenerife, which is here. As you can see, there's the A. Number two is my local listing in Twickenham because I have a, a listing there as well and that's there. So that's number one and two and this is a worldwide search. It's not a, a local search. And I'm just going to show you uh, if we go through these other ones. Uh, West Glamorgan, United Kingdom, 
uh, Slawston Market Harbour, Clarence, New York, um, New Orleans, where are we? New Orleans, I can't say this one, Pensorkin, New Jersey, United Kingdom, Canada, Conway SC, I don't know where that is. And that's it, but you can see that that is a, a worldwide search. And I'll just show you the results of that. And this is in the business listings section. There's 44,890,025 results. Um, but that's the business listing working with the website. Anyway, thank you for taking the time to watch this uh, short video. Um, please feel free to give me a ring or, or visit my website and um, uh, click the contact me button on there and I'll, I'll be in touch with you to help you with your local business here in Tenerife. You could also click the like button below the video and leave some comments if you wanted as well. Okay, thank you very much.